good morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending on what part of the world you are in. I am Old Man 102. Welcome back to Banished. I let it run for a little bit between episodes to build up some supplies. So let's throw it back on two speed. We have a few things building. Well, dock workshop, uh, another barn, a couple of reed farms, and a oh, chicken breeder is done. I'm just going to throw these on hold for a few minutes as they come in so we can see how many workers we have. And we could probably bring an, another set of workers in. Reed farm is done. Reed farm is done. So, uh, let's see where we are. So we really need to ramp up fire bundles and we really need to ramp up um, survival coats so we can work towards a trader. We also have two more houses coming in. Now, these eat up a ton of wood and I don't think our dense tree shack is really up to full capacity yet as either, so we're going to be taking some more trees down as we expand our farming anyway. We'll probably just keep going over this way with farmland, so eventually we'll need to build a creek bridge. So let's get rid of some more, just remove all the resources from here. Oh, we can't go across the bridge yet, so remove the resources from here. And then we'll probably go down, you know, probably end up with like more traders and stuff along here. So eventually we will go down this way. So we'll get rid of the trees and stuff down here as well. So that'll get us a little bit, and then we'll probably work our way up this way around the lake as well. So what do we have? Another dock workshop. Let's turn that off for a minute. Where's this barn going in at? Over here by our crops. All right, perfect. Yeah, this barn's about 36% full. This barn's about 38% full. So they may want to think about getting another barn in. Maybe even over here near this one. Do we have room for... Can we sneak one in here? Uh, it's not ideal. I'd rather see if I can get the church and stuff over there. Let's get another storage barn in right here. And then we'll eventually extend... Right, that one's done. Perfect. And then we can extend... This road will get extended straight up eventually. I'm just going to put a road all the way around it. Now oh, we're off by one. All right, hold on. Let me redo that. Uh, where do I go in the cancel? Yeah, let's get rid of that a minute. Let's get rid of this bar in a minute. I want to, let's get the road in first. This road will come straight up from here. Oh, stop. Right, now we can get the barn in. Now we'll get the road back around this side. I'll right, we'll get another barn in here, because we're going to be doing a lot of reed farming and coat making along here. Alright, let them build the two houses and we'll see where we are. We have... oh yeah, we have a couple more. Let's give it a second for these houses to fill. We'll look at our labor. Alright, so that took the last couple out of there. Perfect. So we've got one couple in there and then an odd unmarried. 
Alright, so we have, what do we have? We have a couple labors to play with. So let's get the both reed farms up and running first. And then we'll leave the dock workshop for a minute. We'll get the chicken breeder up and running as well. And then what do we have? Let's get the dock chicken breeder building. And then I'm going to look at the circle of influence for this guy. I want to get a couple more reed farms in. Uh, let's turn it this way. I can get one more in before it'll affect the fishing. Let's throw one there. And then we'll probably start building another dock and we'll get some more out. I'm going to leave this row for chicken breeders. So let's let this one build as well. I pulled the single female out of there and did not pull the couple out of there. Okay, that's a little weird. Where are we with houses? 26 houses, 35 families. We can go at least four more houses. Let's take care of that and we'll come back to our eggs. So we'll go one, two, and I'll grab another road between here, and I'll grab this house again. I want it lined up, so one, two, Three. Crap. Right, one, two, three. Should be there. So it gives four more houses going. We are. We've got a couple extra. Let's get the. Let's get the dock workshop. Where are we on read? We don't have a way well, we do. Let's go fire bundles again. And we'll have, we won't have to worry about firewood. How many, where are we on firewood? So it's 400 firewood. You're maxed out. I can take you down to one. Actually, I could probably shut you off now. And you, you can save our wood. Yeah, let's shut you off for now. We'll see if we can't survive on a couple of... Turn you off a minute. Let's get this dock workshop building as well. So we're going to, I think you're making fire bundles, you're making survival coats. We'll need another one making fire bundles. Alright, back to our reed project. Alright, so you're going to need. Uh, let's see, reed farm. here, and then you're going to need dock here. Where's this reed farm? Let's get that one in the queue. Yeah, this is uh, some fire bundles. Let's actually take our fuel limit up. Let's go to like, let's double it, so 800. They're gonna burn through the reeds, but that's all right. Now, what are you at? You at our limit on, where are our coats? Our coats are at 50, let's up that. Let's go to 150 on the coats. We'll get start getting a bunch of coats in. We have a couple extra. Let's get the dock chicken breather on. And 
then we can probably think about getting more peoples in. Let's get some farm set up for the next growing season. So 10 by 15. Go 10 by 15. down. I'm thinking we're gonna, let's just go, um, let's go 10 by 15. Yeah, 10 by 15. Make sure we don't have, run out of food. And then this will get, eventually we'll have a bridge running across there. Oh, did we just have a whole bunch of laborers come in? We had, we just had a whole bunch of laborers come in. Okay, that is awesome. So now we can take this guy up to four. And I'll get that off the board. We'll get the water scavenger in. That cleans up everything we have built. <clears throat> that guy's making us lumber. All right, we're going to have to start thinking about a school and church and cemetery. And a better doctor. All right, turn you off a minute. We'll look at that situation here. Let these two build. So we need the reed farms before we can really start cranking stuff up. Now what's it going to do? It's going to kill our labor pool, though, because you're going to now the, instead of the kids working at, I think, t ten or twelve, it's going to they're going to go to school and they won't become a laborer until eighteen. But let's look at our first school, and I think I build the one-room schoolhouse because it's upgradable. Um, Forty-five lumber. How much lumber do we have? We have 65 lumber. Let's get our first school in. These lo these piles are going to go. <clears throat> so let's try and estimate. Okay, path there. Leave room for a path. So you're going to go he here. Oh, I can't put it there because of the pile. That's right. We'll put you here to the end and work our way. No, I want to leave that room for... Let, let's shift you this way. You can become our first school here. And then we'll throw a path along here. Probably throw, maybe even throw a second school in, depending on how many students pop in here. Think about getting these piles moved. We have a stockpile here. All right, let's tell them to move this one first. And when that's done being moved, we'll see how much... We may have to put another one in here, or another one behind the barn. All right, what are you maxed out on? We are maxed out on our food limit. That is awesome. Let's go to, like, 15... We're at, let's go to 15,000 on our food. All right, this is starting to come in. actually increase our food limit. What, what did I set that at? Oh, hang on, this one. So logs, oh yeah, we can bump up our logs now as well. Let's go to 1,000 on the logs, let's go to 1,000 on the stone. Let's go to 1,000 on the iron. I'm going to put this guy on hold a minute. 
Uh, we'll leave tools. Tools are almost max. Let's go 200 on tools. Fuel. They can leave at 800 for now. Uh, food. Where are we at in food? So there's only a 500 buffer. Let's go to 20,000 on the food. Alright, that should take care of that for now. Perfect. So we got another reed farm in as well. Alright. It is winter. We, all right. What we're gonna have to start doing is we're gonna have to start throwing two people in each farm because now they can't get it up off the ground quick enough. So how many laborers do we have? We have a few. So let's take you to two. Let's take you to two. Take this one to two. Take this one to two. And then where are we? We're at nine. Uh, let's take this one to two. We'll get this one to two. And that pretty much kills our labor. All right. We have a couple more houses being built. We have another barn coming in. It's early winter. Alright, y'all work on getting some stuff removed so we can expand. So they're... What do we have queued up? Uh, we're going to need to expand over this way as well. So let's get... Yeah, let's get this taken out. We're going to also need to start coming down this way. So let's get some of this taken out as well and then I really want to get more people in here for spring we are what do we have left We're waiting on one house we have enough food we, we got enough of everything all right let's bring in a couple more peoples and that's going to fill up our Temporary housing. And then where are we on labor? So that's going to give me a whole bunch more labor. So let's go two more builders. Alright, so you're at two. You're at two. You go to two. You go to two. I want to stay ahead of food. You are going to become strawberries. So two more there. You're going to become sunflowers. So two more there. So it leaves us with a couple laborers. We've got the homeless people. Uh, okay, so these houses now need to become priority. So let's go... Uh, no, not increase. Let's go priority. So these two houses and these houses need to be the priority. Let's get one more person in a reed farm. Leaves us ten laborers. And then I want to bump up more of the reed farms. Three more going. And we'll get one or two more of the dock chicken breathers in. Now they're hard to grab. these houses built so our new peoples don't and we're gonna get we're gonna we are gonna get another village in built as well so where are my boarding houses you're the big boarding house I 
do we have? Yes, let's grab another village in for temporary housing. We'll throw right there. So let's get that built as well. We'll be bringing more immigrants in often. Did I make a complete mess of this? I did. As soon as we ramp up survival coats, then we can think about bringing a trader in. Uh, I'm gonna probably build the school and put it on hold until I build the second school. Probably throw... Where are we gonna expand our housing? Probably up this way, around this lake. We're going to have a bunch of housing over this way. We're going to continue housing down this way. I may build another school over this way. All right, so our first pile is down. It looks like they drug it all over here instead of moving it back here. I don't know why. I think now I can get us either, a, now I've got to think about where we're going to go with the church and cemetery, probably over here. Right, we are coming up, okay, it's late winter, I'm really hoping these people don't freeze to death, but we have some more housing coming in. Where are we with laborers? We've got a few extra laborers. And we're going to have to turn the lumber mill back on because I don't have enough lumber to build a second. So let me turn you back on. You build us some more lumber. Lumber chews through, makes lumber really quick and it chews through all of your wood. So I turn that on and off very sparingly. We're doing good on food. Firewood is going to be a problem. So we have to get another dock workshop going with fire bundles. Where are we on reeds? We have 800 reeds. So let's throw this guy on. And you're going to make fire bundles. We grabbed... His, why did it grab another single person when we have plenty of families to pull out of I, I sometimes I don't get the mechanics of this game okay we got two more houses coming in I should have taken care of all of our homeless people perfect all right so you grabbed a fam you grabbed a couple You, what are you going to grab? And we're out of firewood, so you grabbed another couple. Yeah, every house that builds, they steal firewood for their house, so getting these fire bundles up and running is going to be our next priority. So this is where we're going to ramp up right now. We're good on food. Good on tools and coats for now. So fire bundles. I may turn this this guy back on a minute just so it makes some firewood. Uh, you you're gonna have to make some firewood for a while. You came in. I'm gonna turn you off.
what are you gonna grab? Should grab one more couple. We've got a f homeless person floating around. I may grab those. I'm gonna turn the schoolhouse off. Yeah, that's the one that could be upgraded. All right, so you grabbed another couple. So what do we have in here? One, two, three. It looks like four more in that one. So we're gonna need at least four or five more houses. Let's grab, let's throw one, two here, I'm going to pull this down, let's grab two for here, All right, you I'm going to turn off for now, and then we're going to probably expand some housing up in here, this little square here Let's turn you off for now. I think I may put some housing like right in here as well. Or over here to sub. You know what? We're going to put a few over here to supplement our farms. So they don't have to go as far to work. So let's throw... Uh, can we fit? No, we can't. We're going to be a little short. Right, let's go this way. One, two, three. I'll get us a couple more houses. And then we'll turn you off for now. And then we'll see where our labor is. And we'll refocus on... I'll turn these two on next season when we have more people. Uh, dock workshops need to be the problem because we don't have any more made. Alright, so we're gonna, we need to ramp up our dock workshops next. Yeah. Alright, so can I go straight across from this one? I can. One, two, it's going to burn through a lot of our wood, but that's okay. We are, yeah, firewood, fire bundles, and then survival coats. So pretty much Food is stable for now, so that's going to be our focus. We're really going to have to think about more wood, more stone, and more ore soon as well. And then I want to get a second school in as soon as we have the lumber. Where are we? 20 lumber. I think I want to get another school. I'm putting some housing here. We have some housing here. I actually may throw a school in here and then continue housing around it. Let's do that. Let's throw in another one room schoolhouse. We'll let that build as well. So we're going to turn you off for now. So we got a whole bunch of stuff built up for when our, we bring on our next set of refugees. So I can really expand this operation. Alright, you... I don't want to put a straight path in here yet, because I think I want to get some more workshops and stuff backed up to these first. I may want to think about another barn somewhere in this area as well. I may even use this little spot right here. This pile will go away eventually. But we are about... I'm going to throw this on pause. We are about 30 minutes in. I am Old Man 102 Thank you for stopping in. Very much appreciated. Please smash that like and subscribe on your way out. It'll really help the channel grow. 
I hope everyone has an awesome day.